Now to the tragic death of a baby in a bathtub. As a Detroit family makes funeral arrangements for the infant girl, the child's mother is locked up and facing felony charges. 7 Action News reporter Simon Chaquette shows us what happened during her first court appearance and how loved ones are pleading for help from the community. A 22 year old mother showed no emotion as she appeared in court here at 36 District Court for an arraignment today. She did, however, stop to shake her head as she heard those charges being read. Family members tell us they're simply too grief stricken to talk today. And for now, this GoFundMe page asking for donations is their best hope to be able to honor their baby girl's memory. An upcoming funeral service is now being planned, but so far no date or location has been set. People of the state of Michigan versus Jayla Thomas. Meanwhile, the child's mother remains at the Wayne County Jail. You have a right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. 22-year-old mother Jayla Thomas with this reaction as Magistrate Don White reads her charges in open court. In this video arraignment, Thomas formally learning she's accused of involuntary manslaughter and second-degree child abuse for the death of her 18-day-old infant, Lauren Williams, on the morning of August 26th. Count one homicide, manslaughter, involuntary. It's a felony with a penalty of 15 years and or $7,500. Count two, child abuse, second degree. It's a felony with a penalty of 10 years. Prosecutors say Thomas was drinking excessively alone in her apartment on Shaner when she found her child unresponsive, floating face down in the bathtub. The baby pronounced dead by EMS soon after, and the cause determined to be drowning. The prosecutor calling this appalling and has publicly blasted the mother for being intoxicated. In court, the mother not indicating if she's taken the step of hiring an attorney or asking for a public defender. Ma'am, did you hear the charges and the penalties that you could receive? Yes. All right, the court's going to enter a not guilty plea on your behalf. The mother is being held on $150,000 bond. She is due to appear back in court on September 12th. From downtown, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News. Just so tragic, Simon. Thank you. Turning now to